people are going, people are going, and we're there again in the next video. And you know, we're going, we're going, it's my way, we're going. We're going to kill our one rabbit, we're going to process our one rabbit, we're going to eat meat, we get some meat in. I see probably I see lots of them videos here. Eat time. So, you know, it's a come to the festive season, you know, all of that. You get me? So, we're so, going to jump right now, video, so watch us, just stay tuned. I uh, get here with all the cool bandos. Get out down here, cause we're not keeping like with that till now. So down here, I uh, get out. Um, cook can stay open, cause all oh, this now going on cook right now. This is everything we are processing in the morning. You know. Cute, but so you go. Raise them for meat and all. So. But. So I got up in the morning here. Yeah. Yeah, so yeah, this is an easy, easy thing to really process still because it doesn't really take much for slaughter a bit. You just need a little stun to your head, a little, eat, a little knockout. Then you just small slice to your throat and you no know, say. Leave him, make him bleed out and all of that. But it's a pretty quick and easy process. Rabbit is also tasty and all of that, just the same. It tastes better than most meat, just the same. It, rabbit meat not really red, it's not really a red meat, more like a white meat. So the meat may, may be a little close to salmon or something like that. But rabbit tend to have good taste. So now I'm going to see all of that process here on camera aren't still but yeah hope somebody learned something from this and that guys rabbits are cute and nice we really raise them for meat and all of that just the same yeah so i jerked around here where are these you know now just that process the either but just open and enjoy the video so this a rabbit dead about to skin him i'm gonna see what i'm going you know the reason why it looks is because I'm wetting so the ear doesn't really get to stick to the meat and you have to have that to clean down that, that, that fur from half of the meat itself so that's a uh, go right now you know and clean him up and ready so now I'll clean up the rabbit now all I need we already have him in like this, easiest way to really do it. I need for you just make some little slits. Yeah, make sure your knife is sharp as well. Make some little slits around the foot. Because you're not going to need them ones. The part right there. I need for you just make sure you ensure your knife is sharp enough. Because this is... I need a really sharp knife, really do it. My knife is sharp, but it can do the job. And once you make that, that, that slip there, you need to just uh, skin him just like you put a do a goat or any other animal with your skin. I 
get a cup, something looking like that. And maybe an order to eat a bit from this side of the face, too, from this side. I get it. We are open like that. Can most, your finger can do most of it to jab at once you get to get through the, the first layer there. I just need to tear off the skin from the, from the meat. And now the, the meat is the meat left off of that, you know, if you just make a straight cut down your belly. Oops, going too much there, sir. You actually get some of what I go on inside, you know, you get just the skin. Bad cut. Do happen sometimes still. All you need for this is just one part of that done. You can just do that. You really want much of the tail. Because I cut off the tail but make it come off on you. So, yes, I get the tail off. Get off the next little piece of skin there. I just like, can just pull him right out of it. Right out of it. Make a bad cut so the intestine will come out. This is really how we really go about it. And you just pull it right off. No, really need the head or nothing like that. So I'm going to need the front leg then we down there. So. Cut through so we can get the leg them. Separate it off I That's all you need to do. Pull the leg there. And just pull. Next one there. Right now, you don't need the part of the leg. You need to just, just cut through that. Next side, just cut through that. Now we're left with all of this and the head. Just make a cut and take off it. Now I go do that for the camera still. So that's how you really prepare. So we take him, take him right out of his skin. So this is how his skin looks like. So we not use this too much, not at all. Basically, so those are this pose is. We could have always, could have always pick the rabbit with hot water and pick him off to get that skin here. Some people do that, but that the process is a lengthier. We're not really going to do that, so let's uh, take him off of this. Let's get this out of the way for now. And just take him. You don't really need nothing more. You just need to get a 
takot Gesting off Matthew and Jim and I have no such job But he has to work Yeah And we have Pure meat. So that look white. Meat just look white and nice. So I'll just we are get out the inside now. Now <coughs> this is all that we are left with. One nice clean rabbit. Just pure meat. Take out all the inside and everything. And this is it's a pretty decent size. This is a small rabbit still. But you have them grow up, grow bigger than this. You can get them feel like to 10 pounds. This probably weigh like maybe 2 pounds or maybe 2.5 pounds. And it's not a big rabbit. But this is what it looks like after finish. You can just put this on your fridge. Or anything chill for a second season him and everything put him on the grill and all so yeah they saw it really be with a rabbit so until then just stay tuned Windham Livestock Farm 